Hi friends, this is Pastor Harley with the Broadway Methodist Church. I want to share with you from uh, Daniel chapter 3. That's where we're preaching today. It starts with Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego. Verse 16. Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego answered and said to the king, O Nebuchadnezzar, we have no need to answer you in this matter. If this be so, our God whom we serve is able to deliver us from the burning fiery furnace, and he will deliver us out of your hand, O king. But if not, be it known to be you, O king, that we will not serve your gods or worship the golden image that you have set up. These are three young men, uh, and it is the famous story of the fiery furnace. They were told, you must worship the golden image that Nebuchadnezzar set up or into the fiery furnace to burn, you will go. And uh, it's interesting that Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego don't, don't uh, well, they don't analyze the culture. They say, you know, there's a there's a, a, a upsurge of paganism here in the Babylonian Empire, and it's tied to their military successes. It's tied tied the, to the particular mix of of, um, of, ba of traditions that the Babylonians have arisen in, in strength from. They 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 just say no, we're not going to do it. In fact, I don't think they'd be able to give the the king a, a much longer explanation. They just say no. And our God is able to deliver us. You should know that too. But if he doesn't, we're still faithful. He didn't say you can be faithful as long as you can see my hand reaching out to save you. No, you're to be faithful even when things are collapsing. We are called to fortitude in, in, in opposition and danger. And we are called to a confidence and a joy when God delivers us. You will see both things going on in, in this day or through your life. Deliverances from God that you never saw coming, things that we bore with and went and got through, trusting that God is faithful. There is just no need to debate with the king, say, no, we won't worship our image. We already have a God. Be blessed.